Where am I? Hello? Where is everyone? Is this a spirit fossil? What's it doing in a Spyrex? <laughs> Who's there? Ugh! Greetings to you, Jude. Wait. You're floating. And you look like... What are you? Please do not be alarmed, Jude. I am the spirit Muse. You are the spirit Muse? I am here on Maxwell's orders. Mila's orders? Tell me where she is. I must apologize. I have drained a great amount of mana. I am unable to use my full power. So you don't know where she is then? I would if you'd tether with me. The mana produced by a human's mana lobe is the source of a spirit's power. So if we tether, you'll get your power back and you can find out where Mila is? All right then, let's do it. I, uh... Where is everyone else? Well, I can't help you with that one. I see. So what should we do? Whatever you wish to do. Oh. I always hit my mic. I'm sorry. Hey guys, welcome back to Tales of Exilia. So, a lot of shit happened last episode. We lost Zhao. He sacrificed himself to get rid of almost everyone that was on the ground attacking us. And we also learned the truth that he was the one who killed Elisa's parents. But we've been separated from everyone and how met Muse. Which, her name is different, but yeah, again, I'm sorry for hitting my mic on accident. Uh, it always has to happen during a cutscene, right? The area map is no longer accessible, that's nice, great. Alright, so we are in Tulia Tundra. <gasps> so we actually do, our, so we actually are here. Oh my god, I completely forgot. I guess the water channels beneath Fezabel Marsh brought me here. I wonder how far they pulled me. Who knows? Hey. Do you know if Mila's safe? The Lord of Spirits is fine. Good. I mean, Maxwell could never actually die, right? That's right. Unless Maxwell were to use a mortal human body as a catalyst. You know, it's funny how different you two are. Is that so? Yeah. Mila's much more... No, never mind. As you wish. All right. Well, we are in the tundra and we are going to get some items. Yeah, we have to find Mila and friends. Uh, no clue where they are or if they are together or not, but we will find out. Unfortunately, Jude being all by himself. Um, this is obviously a difference between Mila and Jude's side, if you can't tell. Oh, hey, Ivory Treasure. Hello there. Swordsman Eye Patch. <gasps> I g oh, did I really skip over that first? My first and second playthrough? Holy shit, I. D oh. I kind of turned around. Um, okay, whatever. Let's check out my arts because I haven't <laughs> been playing as him. So Palm Strike, Healer, Aqua Sweep. Do I have anything else? Recover Room Swallow Dance. I have Talon Swarm. I think I'll do Talon Swarm. Why not? And his Rising Falcon. Yeah, it's been a while since I played as Jude. So thankfully the enemies here are not that difficult. Uh, or else it'd be kind of hard as playing as one person and everything. 
But yeah, so that scene with Zhao, it always gets me. I honestly, the first playthrough, I hated Zhao. And then I started to like him. And then as soon as, you know, I was like, Zhao, you're an awesome person, that anime cutscene happened and he died. And it honestly ruined both mine and my friend's feelings because we both were just like, Zhao, and we were screaming to each other about it. It was just horrible. Um, but he sacrificed himself for us. I keep forgetting I don't have the map. And so I want to check out like every place, but I'm not sure, you know. This is the right way to go anyway. Well, actually, it's the only way to go. So it's kind of has kind of has to be the right way. Sorry, chicken. I'm not looking forward to fighting you. I can't feel my fingers. In humans, that may lead to hypothermia and eventually death. But as a spirit, I'm fine. That's nice to know, Muse. You know, you're just taunting Jude there with you being a spirit and the fact that Jude can die. Actually, I want to fight this. I don't know. I really like the ice enemies. Or, like, you know, the ice-themed enemies. They always look really cool. Just because I like blue. I also like the fire enemies as well. Because I like red. <laughs> that's, that's just me. But definitely the ice water-based enemies are really cool. Hello. Actually, I'm going to go after the bird. Do I even have a fire move? I'm not sure. And plus, the, these things have the longest arms ever. This is taking forever. I'm just going to get rid of you. He severed bonds with something? Uh, Severlink? I have no clue what Severlink even is. Whatever. Come on. Stop blocking, please, sir. Please. Stop your blocking. God, God. Well, at least this doesn't do a lot of damage to me either. You know, you can stop that. Thank you very much. I still love his up attack. That is something I'll always love with Jude. And the fact that his character design is one of my favorites in the game. Definitely a lot better than Mila's. I just don't like that outfit. Her second game outfit is so much better. That was really close. So much better. Don't worry, Jude, you're fine. Wrong button. Should I have you just heal yourself? Yeah, there you go. Why bother using all the items that I have, right? <laughs> so I just came from that direction, so I have to go this way. I actually have a lot of lily morbs. Like, everybody has like 15 or 18 now. Well, at least Rowan, I remember from checking before I started recording. Um, Rowan has 18. <laughs> So I need to do that again, because everybody will get started on their second orb, which is what I wanted to start doing. God damn it. There. That gets them down a little bit. I think these are really my least favorite enemies, normal enemies, not like bosses or anything like that. But yeah, if you didn't realize we were supposed to lose the fight against guys, that's why I didn't bother healing. I mean, I didn't want to look like I wasn't trying at all. I mean, I kind of wasn't, but I... I also, you know, wasn't really trying. I mean, maybe if you, you probably could have won that fight if you over leveled this shit. But I don't think, you, you really didn't need to be. So, it's just one of those fights where if you can lose, then go ahead and lose. Don't bother wasting all of your items. That's also why I made it so they couldn't use items as much. I didn't want them to constantly keep healing me when I wanted Gaius to purposely kill us. Kill all of us, you know? So. That's happened to me a few times. Uh, before I figured out that, you know, I could lose, I used practically all of my items. And it sucked hardcore because then I was just like, wow, I could have lost the whole time and I just wasted all my items that I might need for after this, you know. One of those, oh god, no, 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 run away. I do not want to fight you. I, do, I would prefer to fight grounded enemies, thank you very much. That big horn was totally worth it. But yeah, we just, you know, unfortunately... I don't know why we can't see the thing. I mean, it makes sense that we can't see the map, but I always just like to look at the map when I'm in a certain area, just so I know if I'm going the right way or if there's like a secret way to go. But unfortunately, that's not the case here. We at least get a bunch of money, yay, that I can use to upgrade weapons further. You can use money to upgrade weapons as well, but I never 
did that. Um, I just never wanted to, so I just used items and stuff to upgrade. I wonder if the others went in here. I can't help you with that one. Hmm. Shall we take a peek? If you wish. What do you think? Whatever you like. <sighs> Yuse is no help whatsoever when it comes to making decisions. Hello, dude. What you doing in here? See, this is like the weirdest location to just have somebody hanging out. 2,400 gold. What am I- I- God, I keep pressing the wrong button. Because the start button, you know, on most games is like, oh, that's your button to go to the menu. But nope. I still have a shit ton of items. <laughs> I'm glad that they didn't waste all my items in that fight with guys, so I'm really glad they didn't do that. Although, they healed me a few times. That's okay, they pretty much died really fast. It doesn't really matter, we got it all done. I also feel bad for saying that whatever to all the people dead in the mud. But I wanted to get that fight going, so... Just look, gotta look past it. Gotta look forward to the future now and finding our friends and just stop dwelling on all the dead people. It's, it's you know, there's always got to be one person dying that you care for in every RPG game, you know. No matter if it's JRPG or just regular, always has to be one person dying. I am really hungry. I mean, I had Ritz and stuff, but that's not food. <laughs> Quick, hide! Mm, mm. Looks like they're moving on. Alvin. What, no happy to see you? Oh, hey, shoot! I miss you so much! Oh, la, la, la. Uh, good to see you too, Tipo. Elise, are you okay? I'm okay. Well done. Seems like every time I meet you, you're escorting a different chick. Uh, this is, uh... On Mila's orders, huh? So, are all spirits good looking or what? I'm Alvin. Nice to meet you. And I'm Tifo. Nice to meet ya! It's nice to meet you. The pleasure is mine. I hope the others got away. Should we keep moving? Huh? What is it? You were always an Exodus agent, weren't you? Why bother asking? He's just going to lie. That's right! He's a big fat liar! Hey, I feel just as betrayed as you guys. Gillen didn't tell me about any of this. He lied to you? Got that right. The nerve of that guy, right? If you feel so betrayed, you wouldn't be so cheerful. Not necessarily, eh, Jude? I don't know. Honestly, I don't know what to think anymore. And I could barely even concentrate on Gillen with that cold-hearted hottie floating next to him. What was her name? Celsius? Do you know her? Celsius. That would be the Great Spirit of Ice. Great Spirit? Why didn't Mila recognize her? I'm a monster! I suppose we should wrap up the chit-chat. Didn't those strange soldiers head back toward the entrance? Indeed. No doubt they are waiting for us to return. What'll we do? Head deeper in? Oh? So I can tag along? If it's okay with Jude, it's okay with us. Not that we have to like it, though. What do you say, kid? Fine. Great, then it's settled. Sweet, area map is now accessible. Woohoo! Look, there's the map. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's gorgeous. Okay. The ice cave feels warmer than being out in that snow. Jude's is so adorable, though. 
let's watch a skit. What were those flying ships and soldiers that appeared from the sky? It sounds ridiculous, doesn't it? Perhaps it was all a dream? Come on. And when Zhao died, was that a dream too? If you forget all about it, it might as well be. Just let it fade away in the morning light. No need to lug that baggage around. So, do you know something about who those people were? You know, I feel like I may have had a dream about them. <laughs> what an amusing fellow you are. God damn it, Alvin. Why won't you just tell a shit, huh? Huh? Elise is so upset about Zhao dying, even so he told her that he killed her parents. But she's still upset over it, because, you know, Zhao did technically take care of her for most of her life. Maybe not as normal family kind of thing. Actually, they need to link up. Go ahead and link. There we go. You two can link up. I don't need to be linked to anybody right now. I I could be solo. I'll just be solo dude. It's okay, Elise. We will mourn Zhao, don't worry. I was gonna combine their names for a second, Zhao and Jude, and then, but I stopped myself, thankfully. Unlike with the Ralvin situation. <laughs> that was kind of funny, though. I don't, I don't even know how I did, really thought of that. But sometimes just the names just come together, and you're just like, what the fuck? Also, Talon Swarm is nice. I like it. I'm definitely gonna have to be using it more often. That wasn't too bad. Or GP, I still won't do Lily Morphs until I get everybody else in the party because there's no point doing just like three people. So might as well wait till we get everybody else, hopefully, you know. And then can do that there. I'll probably do it off screen again or it will be cut out in the next episode, perhaps. I'm not sure. I'm going to fight you. I don't know. These enemies always interest me just because of how they're designed, I guess. It's really weird. Yeah, I need to definitely eat something after this episode that is not Ritz. So hopefully I can do that. And wow, it's only 2.49. It feels like it's 5 or something. I'm really not used to waking up before 2 still. I, It just feels like there's so much more in the day when you wake up at 12 instead of 2. <laughs> it's very uh, different. Very different. But I have to get used to waking up at 9 because that's what I'll be doing for uh, school every day. Well, except for Friday, obviously, but yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm also planning on streaming every Friday from now on um, Tales of Graces until I finish that. I don't know what my next stream would be. I also, you know, I just have a lot to think about with future Let's Plays because um, I have a huge gap of what to do between, like, November-ish, December, Probably December till uh, like April. So I have that huge gap for Let's Plays that I need to fill. So I've been looking up games and everything. And as for streaming, I don't know. I, I can just stream anything. It doesn't have to be like a single player. So I don't really care. But since I have Fridays off, I was like, you know what? I kind of want to stream some more. Streaming is really fun and it's a lot nicer to be able to talk to people while I'm streaming and if I need help with anything they can just help you know and it's just really cool and I don't know people more interactive on that than they are for my YouTube uh, I definitely like the twitch community a lot it's just really cool and neat and I don't know it seems better than YouTube community sometimes I mean, that's obviously not for everybody. They're both communities filled with, like, millions of people. <laughs> so, um, although I think YouTube's probably more popular than Twitch is. Sweet. All right, we just have to level up Alvin. But, yeah, so I'm going to be streaming, like, every Friday. It's practically the same time, which will be, like, 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. Pacific time. Um, so that way I can stream for a few hours. I don't really like doing one hour streams as much unless it's like multiplayer of a game. Otherwise I don't really, I don't want to link with you. I want you two to link please. But yeah, otherwise I prefer to do a, like at least two to three hour long stream. Uh, I don't know, you get a lot more done and 
you just get more people that will just come and watch and it's just really fun to do for sure so I'll be doing that um, I'll try to keep that up I mean there's obviously gonna be some Fridays where I can't but you know that's, that's just how it works I can't always do it every single time I mean I don't I'm only uploading every day to get Exilia done otherwise I wouldn't be doing that um, I prefer to kind of have a break of at least a game every two things I don't really like uploading Exilia three days in a row well four technically considering I just uploaded four in a row I prefer to mix up the games since I don't upload two games in one day but right now I just really want to get Exilia done so that's just what I have to do it takes a good hour in the morning especially because I like to watch uh, videos while I upload which is a bad idea um, but you know I I have to do something while I upload. I could always play on my 3DS, but, you know, I just, I have so many videos that I like to watch in the morning, so I try and pick the shorter videos to watch while I'm uploading, so it takes less time. And I also don't play any games on PS3 while I'm uploading because then it will lag the upload and the game. I tried doing that once. It was horrible. One of the worst ideas I've ever done. Yeah, I'm hoping that, you know, someday I will get a job and I'll be able to afford a 3DS recorder and not have my parents pay, like, so much money. Because, God, those things are so expensive compared to Elgato's. And, I mean, you have to have them, like, put on the 3DS. Like, someone actually put it on. Um, so, I guess that's probably why it's a bit more expensive. But it's just kind of like, that's a hundred bucks more and you only record DS with it. I mean, it's, um, I know that the ones that I looked at are for a few different DS's, not just the 3DS. But I really want to record 3DS and stuff, even so Nintendo's kind of iffy, but I don't get money anyway, so. I think that's for Alvin. Yeah, there you go, Alvin. Getting some fancy armor. God, are we getting close to being out of this cave yet? I really want to find everybody before I end off the episode and everything, you know, because I'm at 22 minutes, but I feel like I should do more considering last episode was like 19 or so, but I feel like I should do more and get more done in this episode. Wait, I'm going to fight you. Oh, hey, we actually got a surprise encounter on them for once really hard to do because they have really good AI compared to some other games so I know Tales of Symphonia 2 is bad AI it's kind of funny but yeah I also might someday do Tales of Symphonia who knows uh, I've been kind of thinking about it but uh, not gonna do it for a while because of the current list of games that I want to do and everything and I know I talk a lot about what I'm doing in the future in these, even so I should probably make just like channel update videos. Since a lot of people don't watch my silly videos, so it would make more sense to do it in a channel update. But, you know, I'm kind of lazy to, to do channel updates. Because something like this would take um, more than like five minutes perhaps, and so I would actually have to put gameplay to it, and I don't know what game I would put to it. Oh, I earned a trophy. What the hell? I'm getting a lot more trophies that I didn't even know were trophies. Sweet! I like my trophies. Alright. Well. How is this one looking? These are very long caves. Like, if you look at it, these caves are actually pretty long. Um, I'm not sure what I want to do exactly. I think I might just end off this episode here. Because I really need to eat something anyway. So... I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and I will see you guys next time. Bye!